mess with Kansime. Excuse me, madame. 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 Excuse me, who are you? Who, who are you? I am Droba. <laughs> no, anyway, who are you? What, what's wrong? I am saying I'm Droba and you, you're laughing. You are, do you even know what an armed robber is? Do you know what the armed robber means? I am robbers who are armed. I'm so Droba. I armed. am armed. Even see, is that how they even hold a knife? Is that how you hold a knife if it... <laughs> if it's still holding it wrong, you hold it like this. So you're an armed... How long have you been in this business? Because you don't look like you know what you are doing. No, I, have that, I have some experience. You have some experience. Uh. And you have story and markers. And what is that? A coin box when I have a handbag here and a phone. Uh. <laughs> okay, so I'm sorry I'm laughing and I'm, I'm not understanding what you are doing. Because uh, what kind of armed robber? Excuse me, madam. Can I first remove my shoes because I don't leave the house? <laughs> hey! So an armed robber wants to remove shoes because you're not in the Why do you wear white? People are going to see you. If you're an armed robber, you should be wearing a mask. Wear black up and down. Armed robber. Armed robber. Then you have not done your scouting. Because if you're done your scouting, you would know that Margaret, my neighbor, just bought a convertible and she doesn't have a garage. She has a what? A convertible. What is the convertible? Hey, Jesus. What kind of thief are you? You don't even know a convertible. Armed. Armed robber. Yeah. Has, she has very many gadgets. Rice cooker. She has... A, she has... A bo... I, I'm not interested in rice. Me... The cooker. The rice cooker. Any other summit. Let's do this. If you are just going to learn how to rob, start from down. Then you make your way, uh, way up. First go downtown. There are where in very cheap neighborhoods. She is still, still, still start with, you know, hens, still some small, small things, large <laughs> phones. Uh, then you'll get somewhere. Those, but those right are, now you're here, wasting. Those right. ones have finished, those of chickens. Uh, trust me, you go, you run. Run how to rob. You will come back next year and do it very, very well. This neighbor would have developed people. Even the minister of health and management is is going to move in here soon in yeah. this neighborhood, yeah, yeah. and he's rich. If you think I'm lying, it's okay. We can take a selfie as evidence. Yeah, we take a picture. Then next time when you come back, the, at least you know that I will not have shifted. Come, you move in. Okay. Move in. Move in. Don't smile. You have to look dangerous. Bus. Bus. <laughs> you, don't, don't worry. You remove the shirt. You cannot get out when you look like that. Uh, remove yeah. the shirt and get out looking dangerous. Okay. Remove the shirt. You can stay in the shoes. You don't have to remove the shoes. You see inside it's even darker. What you have inside is darker. Then now you can just go and roam. This neighborhood has very stupid people. Just leave the shirt. Now go. Good luck. Eh? Okay. Success. Me, you'll find me here when you are ready. So we, who is who has the most? Margaret, it's a pink convert. It's a car. Convertible is a car. You can remove the tires or side mirrors. Uh, okay. Yeah. She usually sings when she's at her house. So you just go. Okay. You find just don't mess with Kansime. Kamzinga, how are you? <laughs> uh, I heard the children me. came back from school. Yes. How are they? My children, I'm asking, where are they? Where are they? What to play? Oh what to play? dear. Mm. I, I sent them to the village. Really? Uh, for for so just and, a holiday. And Junior? Junior. So. The hen, the hen that my children usually hey. play oh, with. Oh, <laughs> we slaughtered it. I made sure they ate it before they went to the village. You ate it yesterday. Uh, and it was delicious. <laughs> So how are you? <laughs> hey! You slaughtered Junior. You can, don't even feel guilty to, to say such a statement. Why do you think that hen is good? Why didn't you tell us? Who did you tell when you are going to slaughter that hen? 
But it is, it is my chicken. I, Who is I, talking I, I, about ownership? So it is now your chicken just because it was time to eat it. Then when it was sleeping at home in my children's bedroom, because they were fond of it, when it was there busy, easing its cell phone in my compound, in my chairs, hanging out with my children, bonding with them, listening to my music passively, it was our chicken. Isn't that was a member of community? Why did, why, how could you slaughter such a chicken a hen without telling us? Who does that? You're the people who can actually eat someone. You eat a person. If you can eat a member of society, you are capable of eating a person. How, how did, why could you eat it alone? What? Okay, who eats? Who eats something called Juni? <laughs> How do you eat something that is called Juni? If it is called Juni, then at least it's a small human. You so now, I'm watch, watch, watch this really. I don't understand. Sometimes it's, it's, it's a wonder. It's a no wonder. Because if you can hide to eat a hen, I'm imagining if you had a cow, I think you would shift and shift to Kenya, go and live in Kenya, or excommunicate yourself, or go into exile so that you can eat that cow alone. But if you can go through those, those efforts of high... You ate Junior. You ate Junior. You so you ate everything. Y yes. Yes. Wait. Now, as in everything that your father gives, that everything you ate, all yeah, of the whole, it. Yeah, the whole. The in whole one chicken. night. Y of yes. And the soup. As in, there's nothing left. All of it. It's oh all. no, 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 no. So where is the saucepan you cooked it in? Come on, who washed it? It's there. So there is nothing. <laughs> And the way you are casually saying that you ate it, you ate it. How do? You, how come it was a member of society who was staying with it? It was communal till it was time to eat it. Eh? It's like helping to pay school fees for a child, and they do not call you on the graduation. What you did last night was a graduation. Eh? What is this? It's like me. I I I rear a fresh and cow. I look after it. I feed it. And in the evening I take black tea. So why would I have a fresh and cow? So you ate junior without. T you know, people, people are very greedy. This, this amount of greed is just too much. People, you people are just overwhelmingly greedy. At this rate, you even get chicken pox. I've never seen this. So what am I going to tell my children? That what? You know when I just ate chicken? You know when I just ate chicken? We bond with our friend. Then you eat the, the, our friend without telling. Cousin. What? It's my chicken. Have a right. Just don't mess with Kansime. You are here, yes, you are here. Then afterwards, you see, you begin complaining. Yes. Yeah? You, you, you're there, you're busy complaining. You're right, you're going Thank to you. go, you'll get, a, get fighting for a taxi, border, border. What are you looking at? You're smart. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Really smart. Is it a promotion? Fun? Go ahead, exchange the numbers. You can swap saliva if you want. So you can actually do this when I'm looking. No, because you know, you make advances at my husband in my presence. Then what happens when I'm not around? So what usually happens? What goes on around? No, 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 no please. Please, feel free. Feel free. Do usually what you usually do. So you're the secret admirer. Feel up you are smart. Who told you? Who told you? You're the people who make our husbands become arrogant. They come telling us, oh, for us, they tell us we are smart. We are smart. Uh, who are you to tell my husband that he's smart? No. Don't you have your own husband? No, because I was only complimenting. The guy is smart. The guy is smart. Mr. Furpo Deke is smart. That is if he's smart. He's not the guy. Is he your guy? Have I, called you, have I ever called your husband? That, ah, but you guys are making money hard. So these days you don't hide. Side dishes are our neighbors. Eh? Our competitors, our neighbors, we just go around telling them, Oh, you are smart. Smart of where? Who told you he's smart? But I can't ah, say that. Who has told you he's smart? He's dressed, he's dressed like he always dresses. So today you just realize that he's smart. He's in a black throat like he's going for a body. So all of a sudden he's smart. To you, to your eyes, he's smart. Is that the only pickup line you have? I've but been watching you, Grace. I've been watching you, but I'm like, eh, eh, Anne, calm down, don't cause a fight. But what is this? If you can exchange niceties in public when I am there, what happened? Imagine I'm not around. What will happen? What will be happening? What will end up in my house? So he's very smart. Smart of what? Nothing has changed. He's dressed like me. he's going for a funeral. But you, you have the time and the patience to tell him that he's looking very... <laughs> he's dressed like oh, he's going to a city abattoir to kill animals. Only that for him he doesn't need knives and pangas to kill them. He looks at them like this and they die just like that. And this is the man you're telling that he's smart. Hmm? He's smart, eh? What is it you're not going to do? Before I know it, you'll be telling, oh, Philip, oh, you are smart. Philip, come and hang my curtains. Philip, scratch my back. Philip, where is the towel? Philip, let's carry the water. Philip, you are, oh, but you are tall. Philip, you have become right skinned. Philip, what are you still, you 
are waiting for him. You go and work. You're the, you're the one encouraging her to give you this stupid nonsense. Eh? Furup, oh, you are smart. Oh, oh, Furup, oh, Furup. And the next thing I hear, you're telling me, oh, Furup, I've missed my period. Go, 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 go. We have a child we are expecting. Go away. I am watching. I never sleep. I never sleep. I didn't come to my party. Just don't mess with Kansime. Kansime. Yes. How are you? I'm fine, how are you? Now, I request kindly you, you help me charge my phone. What happened to your shopping? Mm, there is no power. I don't have power. I was hmm. disconnected. What's wrong with the transformers? Me, I have electricity. How come I have electricity mm -hmm. and you do not have? Mm -hmm. How can that be? Is that the first thing I have that you don't have? No, but what I've, happened? I've not yet cleared the bills. The bills are too huge. I'm off. Okay, let me see if I understand this very well. Mm. So you don't have electricity because you didn't clear your bills. And me, I've cleared my bills. I have electricity. You want me to charge your phone? Sorry, <laughs> Chris. You think our relationship is that strong? I'm not your neighbor because I want. It's not by choice. If I could shift somewhere else, I would have shifted. You think we are friends, eh? So that, that's why we have reached. Why you do not clear your bills? And suddenly, I have to to cater for your bills. That's what it has decided to be. Eh? Um, Wait. No. Hey, but what? She, yeah. Can't don't tell me you came here thinking I was going to listen to that. What you're going to tell me? I think at this rate you're going to begin bringing me your children's bank slips and telling me, oh, oh, I'm short of school fees. Cousin, help me pay school fees. That's how close we are. Hmm? We are very close. You're going to ask me, give me your schedule, okay? Give me your schedule so that I know when is your husband coming to my house to, to watch evening news. And since they've cut your, you, because you've not paid your bills, you, can, you send your husband to come and watch. <laughs> and this right, thieves are going to attack your house at night and you tell them, no, 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 no. Go to Kansime's house for how she pays her bills, she always has money. And you send thieves to me just like that. <laughs> Oh, I've been seeing you, Eve. I've been seeing you. There's nothing you do not celebrate in this world. Birthday party. You have a what? Four children. You celebrate birthday party for all of them. Birthday party. The day when the baby defects properly. The day when the teeth, first teeth has come. The day when the baby almost stands up. That you celebrate. You have like 30 anniversaries. Me, I don't even remember my birthday. That is how often I celebrate it. I don't remember which day I was born. I just see years passing. But you celebrate other things. You wear a nice rosh on me. On such a redundant day where you are home, you are wearing as if you are, go you are an MP of some sort. You are going somewhere to some office and you come to me after mm -hmm. spending all that. You think I don't want a good life? Can't yeah, you think I don't want a good life? Yeah, eh? I, I don't know. want a good life. Then you come to charge your phone. Do you even have my phone number? Okay, let me surprise you. You want to charge your phone in my own house. Have you even ever beeped me using that number? I your phone. I Do you have a... Uh -huh. no. Flash me. Do you have my phone number? Do you have it? You'll be it. You, I don't have Don't take it for granted, by the way. I'm not here now, by choice. You can't see me. Kind, I'm, I'm going to pay my bills later. Uh, Please, just help me. You then. should have started with that one. We will be sorted. We will not even be arguing. If you're going to pay your bills later, it's okay. Charge your phone later. It can't see me. <laughs> with all those parties. With all those parties and you think we are friends. Go away. You use the charcoal for once in your lifetime. Sneeze the way I sneeze in the kitchen. Instead of using electricity. And use the bills that you cannot pay. You go! <laughs> Just don't mess with Kansime. Kansime, <sighs> where, where are you going? I'm working girl. Why, why are you asking? Why are you going without laying the bed? <laughs> what will happen if you lay the bed? What will happen if you lay the bed? You lay the bed for once. Try laying it and see if it turns into a stone. What do you mean? You married me so that I become a bed layer? Eh? That is my job. I'm supposed to lay the bed. Since when? You, what did you do here? What did you do here? That you're going to tell me to lay the bed? Hey, so wait. I have to stay in bed, sleep, turn around, turn around when I'm not sleeping. What did you think you married? You think you married an octopus? You think you married an octopus with eight, eight, eight legs and eight and how many arms? I have to feed the children. I feed you. Then the, you, I feed you times seven because you eat for seven people. Then I feed my, the, the, my, my parents. Then I, oh, please. I, I have only 
two arms, one, two. So while I go to do those things, unless you're telling me you're going to go feed the children, take them to school and cook for yourself, laying the bed just, please. It's not like it's written, where is it written in the marriage book that laying the bed is for women? Oh, as a matter of fact, for Kansimi, hire a woman to lay your, your bed. I've done very many other things. If you were to say the things I've done, what? You can't be lazy like that. We quarrel before we sleep. Even when we wake up, we quarrel about laying the bed. Leave it. Leave it if you don't want to lay it. Or you lay it and see if your hands are going to fall down. Hey, hey, Kansim, you have seen days. Every day, every day there's a new thing to fight about. Yesterday you had to write to the landlord that you are a widow. You write to the headmaster the other day that your man is, is retarded, is in a hospital, mental hospital. Now, now they want you to lay the bed. You know what, can't see me. Turn around, look at yourself like this and say, no, today I am not laying the bed. I'm not going to lay the bed. Commit suicide if you must. Just don't mess with Kansime. Uh, but no, 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 I think now you have just become a terrible neighbor. Terrible neighbor, neighbor. absolutely. Good morning. You brought the boy and you didn't tell me. Do you know that my sister has hey. just taken the children to play in the stadium? And really, had we agreed, they would have gone together. And you didn't tell me your son came. Oh, boo -boo -boo. Boo -boo. You didn't Madame. tell me that your son came back. Can't see me. Can't see me. This is so beautiful. <laughs> how are you? How, how are you? I'm okay. How are you? <laughs> Ah, very adorable, but that's this, this beard. Bombay, baby. You can see me. Hmm. This is my fiance. You, you know this day is rough is very funny. Yeah. Because the other day yeah. I met Nanka Gloria yeah. calling the husband baby. Now yeah. you have decided to call your child fiance. This love is extremely ah. confusing. No, we had an introduction in uh, traditional introduction in November. You were not there. Katamba, you're serious. Yeah, this is my so the rumors, are, the rumors are true. They told me that Mbu, Mbuka, Mbuka Tamba, these days he moves around with like a small boy. I'm like, hey, what's wrong with adopting? If you can adopt a young boy, then why not? So the two of you are busy here praying Romeo and Juliet. How do you pray Romeo and Juliet with a fetus? How are they going to hear? Isn't it? This is not even the fire, man. This is something else. Young boy. Are you living in your future or what? Oh, already. You? Yeah, visible. Right here. This love is not blind. It is heavy. It is just to rain. The road is slippery. I dare you to walk on a slippery road with this woman. She, what if she slides and falls on you? Don't you have any love for yourself? What if she slides and falls on you? And then we hear breaking news. Afuso knocked a man to a chapat. Now they found a chapat on the road. No one will believe that it was the two of you. No, no, no. My, when, the, when Jesus said, let the children come to me, they did not mean that all the children should go to you. What's this? It's not even defile me. This is insolence of Christ. As a matter of fact, to go. Go and I am here praying and hoping you're headed to a bouncing castle. Poor boy. What is this? This is not even cross-generational sex. This is cross century. What is this? Just don't mess with Kansime. Yes, hello? What? What time? So where did the fire come from? Did the whole shop catch fire? Oh no, did he get out? Eh? No, 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 Bambi keep us posted. So the whole shop is done. Oh goodness. How is someone going to manage this camper? It's getting harder and harder. If it's not the city council, it is taxes. If it's not taxes, it is tear gas. If it's not tear gas, it's fire. What is someone going to do? <laughs> Jared, what, 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 what kind of nonsense is this? What, what's wrong? I'm feeling sad. You're feeling sad? For what? The, the shop, our shop has burned. You are <laughs> sure? People are even going to you. What kind of... Oh, God. And people wonder why I'm not even there to give birth. Who gives birth for this? So who is the child? Why would you cry? You haven't even heard what news it is. It's not our shop that got burned. Which shop are you talking about? You don't know what happened? You're just busy crying. It's not... You don't even know what is happening. Okay. Assuming it is our shop, me and you should be crying. So who will console me? Uh -huh. What if I start crying? Then what? And you just get and cry? You, you rehearse how to cry? What kind of head of the family is this? What is this? 
It's as if you're the... No, you don't even tell you of the family act like that. It's like a watchdog running from outside straight into the house. Yeah? To, because it has heard that thieves might be coming. That, that's the foolishness you are doing. What's this? And you cry? I don't know how I got myself into... How do you do that? <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. Hey, this one, they're also calling too much. You put it in vibration, they still call. What is wrong with them? Yes, hello? Oh, no, you've confirmed he has died, eh? You're serious, he has died? Oh, no. Oh, no. Get out of here. Get out of here. You what kind of man is this? Get quiet, people are living here. You, you get out of here. How did I get myself in this? How did I find myself in this? Just don't mess with Kansime. Yes, hello, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm fine. Mm. My knees really look bad. Mm, that's true, extremely true. Mm -hmm. So you, how, what do you want to do? I just want to do, I've just come for manicure and pedicure. Manicure and pedicure? Yes. And you are aware how much that is? I, uh, it's 50,000. 50,000? Yes. Oh, it's okay, I'll pay. You pay cash. Before the service? Yes, before the service. If you doubt this service, you would not have come to this show, to this salon in the first place. But... I, I didn't call you. Did I stand out and call? People for a pedicure, people for a manicure. You walking in here means you know that I'm going to do a very good job. So you pay cash and then I work on you. <clears throat> so, madam, <laughs> you know, excuse me, remove your other hand. <clears throat> madam, what's this going hand? on? You will soon know, you will soon know. This is what they call a surprise attack. And finally. Hey! And finally. So let me ask you. You don't even know me. See, that is what is very embarrassing. The fact that you look at me and you cannot recognize me. That is what makes my heart bleed. What's going on? You I do don't not know. know. Yes. Me, I know you. Don't you stay in the cabaret? Yes. Don't you stay behind a red gate that has Florence and rights on the side of each side? Isn't is that isn't the barabu in your bathroom? That, okay, the barabu in your bathroom does not work. Does it work? How do you know all that? <laughs> See, that is what is most frustrating. You go around, go around, go around to be vibed by other people's husbands, and you don't know their wives. Madam, madam, uh, you don't know that Furupodeke is my husband. So, for as a matter of fact, you go around allowing, allowing other people's husbands to kwanari when you don't know them. Why are you using? As a matter, let me let you go. I create idea you to run. You run. I was that the darts champion and I have my darts already prepared. So sit down. I dare you to run right now and go out just like this and aim for the highest. So imagine what is going to happen. So you cannot my husband under what circumstances? I didn't. You did. So he's the one who vibed you. It's so unfortunate. Isn't your name Mbaba's Grace? You are not sure whether you are Ugandan or Rwandese. You're just there in the middle. Your hips tell you something different, your head tells you something different. I know you very well. Next time you do research, when you're going to vibe or hit on someone else's husband, I saw you coming. You know, God, you are faithful. God, Jehovah, you are Jaira. You are faithful. Just the way you sent manna to the Israelites when they were hungry and they ate. This is my manna. Today I'm Israelite. Today they have sent me to you. I am going to show you that but by the time I chose Philip with his skin color that is not totally brilliant, Madame, I'm with sorry. his face that is not totally handsome, I knew what I was doing. I did not expect the likes of you to like him. So you stalked him into liking you. Into liking you and then you are... <laughs> I'm uh, running out of ideas. I don't know where to start from. You know the Bible also says that when you have a part on your body that causes you to sin, cut it off. Feel free. Think about it. Which body part? Just think in your head. Think. Which body part do you think they're going to cut off first? Just don't mess with Kansime.